Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Currently, the Firefox web browser is sitting at version 92. Now, with the rollout and release of the previous version, which was version 91, and was released on the 10th of August 2021, Mozilla made an important change to the Firefox web browser, whereby it is now a lot simpler and easier to set Firefox as your default web browser in Windows 10 and 11. Now, as many of you know who are already trying and testing Windows 11 out in the Windows Insider program, to try and change uh, and set another browser over uh, Microsoft Edge as your default browser is not a simple process and requires a lot of extra steps and is actually quite a complicated process. Now, previously in Windows 10, if you wanted to set Firefox as your default browser, you would have to head over to your settings menu, then go to apps and head to your default apps menu. And in the web browser section, where obviously Microsoft Edge would be set as your default web browser in both Windows 10 and 11. And when you clicked on that, and then you clicked on Firefox to set it as your default browser, and Microsoft would give you notifications and reasons why you would need to keep Microsoft Edge as your default web browser. Now, as mentioned, in version 91 of Firefox, and also in version 92, uh, Mozilla has basically bypassed and these anti-hijacking protections of uh, Microsoft's in the operating system and have used a little bit of reverse engineering, which means now you can set Firefox as the default web browser from directly within the browser. And basically, you don't have to go through all the extra steps in Windows 10 and especially now in Windows 11. Now, obviously, Microsoft is not happy about these uh, recent changes to the Firefox web browser and Mozilla's uh, comments regarding this are, and I quote, all operating systems should offer official developer support for default status so people can easily set their apps as default. Since that hasn't happened on Windows 10 and 11, Firefox relies on other aspects of the Windows environment to give people an experience similar to what Windows provides to Edge when users choose Firefox to be their default browser. So that was Mozilla's response to basically um, Microsoft not being too happy about these recent developments. So now what it means, if you go to your Firefox web browser or when you first install it and at the prompts to set it as your default browser, you won't have to go through any extra steps. So if you head over to your settings menu and you go to the general section, if you make Firefox your default web browser now, um, it will bypass all the extra anti-hijacking steps, basically, of Windows 10 and especially Windows 11. And it will set it directly as your default browser in both of those operating systems. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.